Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, today I rise to ask for support for House Resolution 266, honoring the life and memory of Senior Airman Brian R. Bell. Senior Airman Bell joined the Air Force in 2006 after graduating from Harbor Creek High School. He was an explosive ordnance disposal technician. In 2011, he started his second tour of duty, serving in Operation Enduring Freedom in Shirghazi, Afghanistan. On January 5, 2012, Senior Airman Brian R. Bell and two fellow soldiers gave the ultimate sacrifice when their tanker was attacked by an improvised explosive device. Brian served as a member of the 2nd Civil Engineer Squadron assigned to Delta Company 466th Explosive Ordnance Disposal, Barksdale Air Force Base, Louisiana. Airman Bell's service to the community began at the age of 14 when he became an active member of the Fairfield Hose Company. Over his years of service with Fairfield, he eventually attained the rank of senior airman. In 2007, Brian joined the United States Air Force, where he became an explosive ordnance disposal technician. He received his EOD training at Elgin Air Force Base in Florida. On March 8, 2013, the second bomb wing at Barksdale Air Force Base hosted a dedication ceremony proclaiming their fitness center as the senior Airman Brian R. Bell Fitness Center. With the successful passage of House Bill 2460 of last session, the eastbound bridge carrying I-90 over Six Mile Creek in Harbor Creek Township, Erie County, was designated as the Senior Airman Brian R. Bell Memorial Bridge. Senior Airman Bell was awarded the Bronze Star and the Purple Heart for his unwavering act of courage and bravery. Senior Airman Bell was only 23 years old. He is survived by his wife, Elena, and his parents, Richard Bell and Donna Aldrich. Please join me in unanimously passing House Resolution 266 to honor the life and memory of Senior Airman Bell, who paid the supreme sacrifice to safeguard our liberty and freedoms. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.